Hey, good morning, everybody. Crypto Mentor 99. I'm off to my next appointment. Okay. Hey, I just did a video this morning from the sauna. It's below. It's about being positive, Jay's Trading Group, and Zinfin. You may want to take a look at it. Anyhow, so I had an interesting conversation two days ago with, I guess I could say this, my mother-in-law. I was driving her to an appointment and she started talking about food and she was asking me, do we have any extra food in the basement? And she's never been in our basement. She's got a medical condition that prevents her from doing stairs. So she's never been in our basement. And for those of you that don't know, my in-laws moved in with us um, September the 1st. They were in a senior living care here in town. And because of the virus, we couldn't see them. They couldn't come out. So he said, the heck with it. You're moving in with us. And they're fine. So I said, well, what do you mean? She's like, well, I read an article that people should have um, 30 to 60 day food supply on hand in case anything happens. I'm like, oh, whoop, there's something in the middle of the road. Oh, shoot. Oh, gosh. Ah. Missed it. Um, where was I? So we had an interesting conversation about food storage, what we have in the basement. I said, well, you know, we've got like extra shampoo and deodorant and toilet paper and Kleenex and bags of rice or whatever that we're probably never going to use or eat, even though I love rice. So it was just interesting because I've never had a conversation with anyone of her age group, right? But more specifically, I've never had a conversation with her about catastrophe or natural disasters and the whole conversation kind of started because about a week ago we found out that one of my brother-in-laws is buying a generator because I think they're on propane and they don't live out in the sticks but they live in an area where a lot of people have those those big propane tanks on the side of their house or their backyard or at least if you live in the United States, I think you know what I'm talking about. So that prompted my brother-in-law getting a generator. So yeah, I had a nice, interesting conversation with my mother-in-law about food storage, what we should stock up on, what we have, take an inventory of what we have in you know, the basement. So anyhow, um, it was just a good reminder that I need to get another flashlight or two. I need to get some more batteries, maybe a lot more batteries. I need to look at maybe getting a solar-powered cell phone recharger or something. I looked at that last year, and to be honest with you, I just kind of forgot about it. But I, I need to bring that to the front of my mind again, which is why I'm kind of doing this video. So if you've got any gadgets, flashlights, you know, um, Swiss Army knives, super duper Swiss Army knives, solar ovens or whatever, let me know about them. Or if you've got any generators, just send me an email. You don't need to post it publicly. But Crypto Mentor 99, let's go! Crypto Mentor 99 at yahoo.com. Crypto Mentor 99 at yahoo.com. Or just comment and uh, say, hey, we've got this, we've got that. This has worked out for me, this hasn't. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, it's gonna be a good day. See you later. Bye-bye.